Hey everyone. In this video, we're diving into all the new features of procedural content generation PCG, in Unreal Engine 5.6. If you're building open worlds, environments, or procedural systems, this update brings powerful tools you don't want to miss. Multi-threaded execution. Let's start with a big one, multi-threaded PCG graph execution. Now, PCG graphs automatically run across multiple CPU cores, massively improving performance. In heavy scenes with thousands of points, graph evaluation can now be 3 to 5 times faster. In the image you saw, we imported 2500 trees with high detail. GPU scattering and optimization. Next, PCG now supports GPU-based scattering. Nodes like copy points and scatter can process data on the GPU, perfect for micro details like foliage, pebbles, or moss. And with lazy GPU readbacks, data only returns to the CPU when absolutely necessary. That means faster rendering and lower overhead. This is a game changer, PCG Biome Core V2. It lets you layer multiple biomes, for example, blending a snowy tundra into a forest, using weight maps and masks. Each biome can have its own local caching and PCG graph, which is great for massive open worlds or stylized zones. It's still experimental, but super promising. Metadata Improvements Metadata just got smarter. You can now use metadata domains like at points, at data, and at control points to filter and manage point data more precisely. Also, point storage now uses a structure of arrays format, reducing memory use and improving performance, especially in complex scenes. Summary To wrap it up, Unreal Engine 5.6 brings huge improvements to PCG. Faster performance. Cleaner workflows. More flexibility and control. GPU accelerated features. And smarter world building tools. If this helped you, drop a like, subscribe for more Unreal tips, and let me know in the comments. Backhand index pointing right which PCG feature are you most excited to use?